Hello everyone. Uh, today I'm going to show you uh, how to add uh, roles and authorization in the project. So there is the online movie ticket booking project in the 10th video you can see. So, uh, so first of all, just open your the class. There is no need to uh, do, do it here because you design your project yourself. So uh, first of all, open your uh, account controller class and uh, in the account controller class must to add it here there is informations so i have an information that is there is private read only role manager identity role okay just copy this and paste it here also you can add uh, in the constructor file role manager copy this and uh, just after it here okay and in the constructor you can add this okay uh, just after that you can uh, search your register post method there is and in that file there is no need to do it here first of all so just comment it and also make the comment it here and you can see that if result is succeed then make it uh, the first variable it here okay there is the admin variable admin role you can say if not is exist so just after that also make the comment it here and replace this file it here if result is succeed then await role manager dot create dot role exist admin user equals to there is admin identity role is admin can create asynchronous is mean admin role is created results succeed then user manager dot role at sync and sign in manager and log information and redirect to login okay just oops there is something error no because what what is going on not all code path returns a value i mean to say that there is an error Good. and just paste it here just after that okay there is a if section oops Okay, there is information. Now save your value. Now the first is create a admin it here. There is register email is admin at the dot of uh, my web dot com and uh, password is related to admin so admin register it so uh, hello admin at the rate of my web dot com there is uh, default admin is there okay you can check it mm. just to stop with this okay admin is created successfully after admin you have to create 
you can just if role dot exist uh, then make this copied and uh, also just and just comment it okay and you can use it in place of user in place of user only okay there is if sections and uh, there is if sections if result dot succeed then make it here oops there is inside it If result dot succeed, then uh, user manager dot add to role users sign in manager and login information and redirect to local URL. Oops, what is this? Okay, yeah. Okay guys, there is the extra braces it here. So there is the problem. So you can use it under the written URL. Okay, now save this. Click on the register button and uh, user at the rate of myweb.com and password is Oops, getting an error. Role user does not exist. Okay. If uh, also create a role user. So just make some sense it here. user also you can you, uh, do this uh, things in the uh, db class there is a db initializer class and there is a role exist and in which you can add the admin and the role just after that we can clear it but before it we can clear users so user is also there and uh, role manager that is user and the role is created uh, user okay and uh, resolve this issue
if result dot succeed there is is already taken uh, but not exist in the any role you can say okay there is a user one is there okay so just check after some times to create a role but if we uh, another create a role then uh, await role manager dot exist the asynchronous in the role of user there is no need so comment again and uh, comment again and save this result it there is okay so thank you guys for watching this video and uh, keep watching all other videos of movie ticket booking system because i clear all the things it here thank you very much